What kind of a man beats a woman up? I've got my faults. As you know, I can be mouthy, I can be crude, vulgar, use appalling language, but in my life, I've never lifted a finger to any woman. I lived with a wife for 13 years, and that, and that were funny. When Christine used to blow a fuse, I used to laugh. <laughs> the fury hated her. And Andrew, who was only a little boy then, he tells people, Mum threw a knife at Dad once and he ducked. <laughs> it went in the door. Christine was rather fiery and uh, she wanted me to blow my top and ball back at her, but it's not my style. And as for hitting a woman, well, I told you on a recent upload that the old couple at the end, Len and Rita, she keeps coming to me because she's got no one else to turn to. And with bruises, and I said, I can't get involved, Rita, you've got to report him. I didn't, he'll kill me. Well, I could imagine that. And I did say to you, didn't I, that today, Monday, the 29th, I was going to see the warden, but it's been taken out of my hands because a care worker came to see my frail neighbour and she was leaving and Rita was screaming at the door. He wouldn't let her out and the care worker saw that Rita had got this black eye and so the care worker fetched the wardens up. There were two wardens down there and they came up and of course I stayed away. <clears throat> but uh, I heard him say to Linda the warden, my daughter's a good woman. Linda said, look, I don't want to know about personal relationships. All I'm concerned with is what's happening to Rita at the moment. And she told Rita, if there's any more trouble, pull the cord or press the button. Um, alert centre control. And so, you know, as it's turned out, I don't need to get involved. I saw Linda afterwards in the office. I said, I was going to see you this morning, Linda, about that. I said, Rita keeps coming to me and I can't get involved. I said, he treats her like a dog. When she was crying on the balcony, he said, go on, get in, get in. And she says, really? I says, yeah. Obviously, there's no time for us. She's his wife. And we all, all of us here say that Rita's a lovely woman. She's very polite, always very polite, very nice uh, to me. In fact, once she gave me a kiss, she said she's so good to me. I said, I wish I could do more for you, Rita. But anyway, David Philp, the organist at Hale in Cornwall, you've heard this before, but uh, I'm going to play it. I can't I put it on Facebook. And I'm going to put this on YouTube because um, you've probably heard it before. But David played a classical piece and it does make a nice change from hearing continuous hymns. And I like the way he keeps the rhythm going on this piece. His timing is perfect. And it's a famous minuet by Boccherini. I'm going to, to go forward now to click the mouse. <laughs> Try not to move the picture too much. And here he comes playing the organ at Porth Leven in Cornwall and note the expert camera work because it was me on the camera, right? 